Friends, in a year unlike any other, your generosity through mission and service has been extraordinary. We will share financial results with you shortly. But first, we want to share our impact because we give to make a difference. Here are some of the lives you touch through mission and service. 2004 is when I joined this project. I was given the first loan. I had saved and I was given a loan of 2,000 shillings. I benefited a lot from that 2,000 shillings. I started a small business of selling vegetables. I built these two houses for renting out. I came here in summer uh, 2017 to Canada. It wasn't easy uh, for me. The whole family got involved to uh, Montreal City Mission with uh, all activities and the project they provided. And beautiful, and I'm so thankful that the person of Jesus reached into my life and invited me on this journey with him. Mission and service changes lives. It's the work we do best together as a denomination in our communities of faith and through the passion and commitment of members of all ages. En ce temps où nombre d'œuvres caritatives ont vu le revenu chuter de 40%, la générosité des membres de l'Église unie est extraordinaire. Ce n'est assurément pas facile. As you might expect, Congregational giving to mission and service decreased by about 12.5% in 2020. En tout, les dons à mission et service, y compris les dons des paroisses, les dons testamentaires, les dons d'assurance vie, les dons spéciaux et le soutien du recrutement de femmes de l'Église unie, totalisant plus de 26 millions de dollars. Communities of faith, many of which we know were struggling themselves, contributed over 17 of that $26 million. Our collective heart has never been stronger. One steady overall factor here was the special support of the United Church of Canada's Foundation's grant of $3 million, half of which was granted in 2020 as a one-time emergency fund for congregations in need. Nous avons également constaté un soutien important à la suite de nos appels d'urgence pour aider nos partenaires internationaux aux prises avec la COVID-19, ainsi que nos appels réguliers pour soutenir mission et service. And we are always deeply touched by the number of people who remember mission and service in their estates, giving the church a lasting legacy. Every one and every gift made a difference. You made a difference. Merci, thank you. Jesus said, where your treasure is, there your heart is. It is clear from looking at our mission and service given this year that we treasure our mission. Our heart is in justice. It is in discipleship. It is in compassion. Thank you for your ministry. There are many women who want to join the group because they see that I have progressed a lot. I am no longer the way I was before. I would like to thank Mission and Service of uh, United Church of Canada. But three years ago, I was just, uh, just a refugee woman who was in need and now uh, I am a coordinator of uh, so many activities uh, at Montreal City Mission. What I would say to the donors of the Mission and Service Fund is that it's worth it. The church is alive and beautiful and vibrant and it's worth investing in. 